Audio Jungle. guys welcome to my vlog now i will teach you how to clear the sub fault because sometimes it's not if you don't have you don't have to clear the sub fault this one can cause for fire because the condition of device is some like dirty need to like this need to clear so now i will teach you go menu then this engine your circuit uh config then clear so you go sub port so enter so the device now device one is condition is zero 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 two like this so you need to clear this one then put next device number four also like this condition so you need to clear then only the two device uh, like uh, have condition like that so in every time you check the panel you can clear also the sub -pult. or every time after testing you need to clear because if you didn't clear you didn't clear that one we will trigger alarm again and during ppm you need to check also that one the sub -pult is the number one you always check that one and then you clear that one the condition so back to normal the device see now no more sub bolt okay i will repeat you can go this engine then config clear or you can put all you can put sub bolt or you can put all if you put all you can uh, uh, see the trouble also battery this one is battery have battery trouble is connected because didn't have battery and open circuit for this one I uh, resistor no now no more sub fault okay only the trouble of the panel so only like that you must always clear the sub fault after testing or during ppm so to above it the device they will trigger alarm okay thank you for watching Please don't forget to subscribe and like and share. Bye-bye.